patients who are treated for uh, hematological malignancies, particularly lymphoid malignancies such as multiple myeloma, lymphoma, some of them need uh, to uh, receive high dose chemotherapy in order to uh, decrease the uh, related toxicity. Uh, high dose chemotherapy is uh, supported with autologous hematopoietic cell transplantation. This means that prior to uh, delivering high dose therapy, these patients need to undergo collection and the usual procedure is apheresis. We get these stem cells and progenitor cells from the blood. This needs to uh, be preceded by a mobilization treatment and the goal of the mobilization treatment is to increase the number of circulating stem and progenitor cells. So the, the whole system works uh, on the conditions that patients appropriately respond and increase their stem and progenitor cells in the peripheral blood prior to apheresis. For those patients who do not appropriately re respond, that are usually uh, considered as poor mobilizers, it may be necessary to uh, change the mobilization regimen. And one of the tools is a drug called Plerixa4 uh, that is quite efficient when associated with GCSF, for example, but uh, raises the issue of its high cost. Uh, so part of the uh, session uh, in which I talked was dedicated to uh, pharmacoeconomics or medicoeconomics of the use of Plerixaphone.